My name is Will Snowden. Um, I'm the proud son of Billy Ray and Kay Snowden. I grew up in Milwaukee, Wisconsin. The best way I can describe Will is as this modest, unassuming superhero. So Will has been a beacon in the social justice community and in the criminal legal system reform community for a very long time in New Orleans. I came to Louisiana in 2013 to be a public defender. And I chose to be a public defender in Louisiana because we have the highest incarceration rate in the world. My work really began as a public defender representing folks from misdemeanor to a murder. I was arrested for a charge, sat. Time went by and I was appointed a public defender, which happens to be Will. Like, he was the only one. You don't have too many public defenders that will stand up and be like, this is what I signed up for. So that shows you what type of person he is. Genuine. And he can help galvanize movement around issues that are, that are clearly um, pressing equity challenges that we're facing in our society. Because as a public defender, I saw two things. One, that we had a process of removing diversity from our jury panels and two, recognizing that removing that diversity from our jury panels was actually removing a key component of fairness of our criminal legal system. And so I think about jury advocacy has been one of the things I've been involved with, and my involvement with the Juror Project has also contributed to changing the law in the state of Louisiana. What we benefit from is with him on the ground, he knows the people that he needs to engage to make the change. He knows how to work with legislators. He knows how to work with elected officials. When I think about what I want my legacy to be, I want folks to understand that I use my privilege for a purpose. And so when I say privilege, I think about being raised in a two-parent household. I think about having an amazing set of parents, right? That's a privilege in itself. But being able to go to college, being able to go to law school. And it is such a privilege to be a lawyer that I want to use this skill set in as many ways as possible. A lot of those values have come from lessons I learned from my parents. I have experiences as a child where I had either been profiled or mistreated based on where I was or what I looked like. And having my parents as a consistent and constant foundation of advocates in my life taught me a few lessons. It taught me that having people in your corner is really important. And I think about the work that I do today as a criminal justice advocate, that there are many people who come through our criminal legal system who do not have people to be in their corner. Another lesson I learned from my parents is that if you aren't doing something, you're doing nothing. To those of people who don't know, he's like a concert level musician who's incredible. During the pandemic, when he would just sit on his porch, and play his cello. On multiple occasions brought me to tears, but also just made me so happy and grateful that he was sharing that gift. That's the type of guy I would want my children to like. If I wasn't a father figure, I didn't know how to be a father, the first time father. Like I would like let my kids latch on to Bill. I love that we can really recognize him for the incredible contributions and the incredible person that he is and still call it an everyday hero because to him I think that makes the most sense. I would say that he is really deserving of this award and really any award and I would not be surprised to see him in public office or in public leadership because that's been his trajectory and I think more people in Louisiana and in New Orleans and really in the United States could benefit from Will's leadership and thoughtfulness. Congratulations, Will. You know you're my boy, man. <laughs> Thank you for everything. Continue, brother. Good work. Will, this, congratulations. This is so well earned, and I'm excited for you. I'm excited for the continued partnership with you and with ADL. Thank you for being you. Thank you for all you do. As you know, I love working with you. You are really just a breath of fresh air all the time. You deserve this award and all the awards, and so I'm really happy that I get to support you in this way. <laughs>